Thank you. Oh, gosh. Talia? Wait, wait, wait. wait. She's trying to check her. Oh, oh, we're live? Oh, <laughs> what's up? Why are you so live? This Hello. is Coffee D with the special guest. Oh, my God. She was awesome. Oh, Brenda came oh, so <laughs> First of all, we'd like to say welcome to Miami. Thank yeah. you. Girl, why do you do that? Why? Oh, we we thought it was a picture. Well, yeah. Isn't it a cool summer? Yeah. It's so hot. But you it's know so what's hot. so funny? That, that know, I go to the beach and I don't land in the sand. Do you see my hair? Do you see my hair? Oh my God, it's bad. It's humidity because... Yeah. No, yeah. Look, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. She's darker than me now. She was hanging out at Miami Beach. Yes, I was. She was having a good yeah. time. Fort Lauderdale, Fort Lauderdale. Miami. Fort Lauderdale. But the water was so warm. It was. It was nice. I didn't nice. even want to be outside. Right now, it's 90 degrees outside. It's 90 degrees. Maybe more. Maybe more. Really? And it's nice. I'm okay with the sun. Oh my God. We just so glad we could make it to see you tonight. Thank you. I watch you guys when you're in the bed doing your video. We're trying to invest. That's why we asked you how long you would be here. Oh, so you be <laughs> it's funny, but I was just jumping from place to place, so I wasn't able to meet up with y'all. That's so I was like, when I said, get yeah, the message, I was like, come on out to the show tonight so we can hang out. Oh, oh we, wanted, yeah. Yeah. Get we out. wanted to catch up with you earlier, but I'm a nurse. Couldn't okay. get the time off. She's you. a performer. All right. Yeah. We, busy. we felt so bad. So we no, like, I know. I have. Listen. I could have gone to the beach. I do the only. Oh, I had a <laughs> <laughs> I don't need to do the singing thing. I also, you know, no one knows yeah, that I, I have a, yeah. a, a home health aid license. And oh, what I do really? is I do music therapy for senior citizens. That is so good. Nice. 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 I go and I do music therapy at different locations, and I had to get my license in case anybody fell. So I had to do that. So I got my license, and I've been doing it on and off for the last That's nine, really ten great. years. And oh, wow. It's funny because a lot of patients, you know, the dementia that the left yeah. side of their brain is not working fully. Right, right. When they hear music, they know everything. And, and always, all the time, yeah, they love to the calm music. them down yeah. when they're aggressive. Yes. Just put music on. You know what's yeah. so funny? I wanted to tell you this before they started. You made me cry when your daughter went on on the show with um, Jennifer Lopez. Oh, and yeah. You went in as a mom. I was like, that is so freaking real. Uh, yeah. And that's why I connected with you. I trolled you. I trolled you. I trolled you, man. Listen. I, said, I felt the connection with you as a mother. You went in and you humbled. You were so humble. And the humility that you displayed, I was like, she loves her daughter. I oh, mean, I love my dad. Oh, yes. And she, lo and she loves music. It's <laughs> funny because, like, I didn't push it on her, but yeah. her growing up and seeing me sing, like, I used to, I mentor kids in music as well. Right. I go to schools. Mm -hmm. I go to the St. Right. Joseph's Hospital for the Giggles Theater. Oh, where I sing to kids with cancer while they do chemo. And mm -hmm. um, I got my daughter involved with that. But how she really showed me she wanted to do music. I was mentoring kids in music, and I still mentor. That's awesome. And it's funny because she saw me getting this one little girl doing everything, shows and competitions and singing the national anthem. And one day she was just like, well, you're sleeping on me. And I'm like, what? She was like, I want to sing too. And I'm like, yeah, you do, but you don't take it serious. She goes, yeah, but you don't pay attention to me. You're too busy paying attention to this and that and that one. Right, right. So I said, all right, if you're serious, sing for me right now. And she put on Christina Aguilera Hurt. And that was all she was. Girl, on my jaw, I was just like, mm. and I just like, my eyes filled up with tears. But she, she just, You better be happy I'm not your daughter, because I would disappoint you. <laughs> <laughs> can't carry a note of men like this. I couldn't even put it on my back and carry it. We want to know because we've been watching you also uh, no, when you got your hair done. We want to know. Two, three, yeah, look uh, at your hair. Yeah, do you have a stylist on board, board? when yeah. you travel? I actually have. Um, my daughter Kayla Faith Beauty used to do my hair for a long time. She's getting ready to have another baby. So I, I actually did a live one day, and there was a lady named Corinne, and she was from Salon Elements. And um, long story short, I had my hair really long and then I cut it because I got into an accident and I couldn't do my hair. It's still very hard for me to do my hair. So I have someone here who does it for me. But anyway, she did uh, the individual hair extensions to fill up my hair, give it a nice fullness. And I have to tell you, I've been getting my hair done, like hair extensions on and on for the last, I don't know how many years. My hairdresser passed away, which was Gerard Duray. And um, she said, I want to do your hair. And I said, oh no, we are not doing anything to my hair unless it's going to be extensions, because I am not cutting my hair, I am not coloring right, my hair, right. just touch-ups, and my daughter does my color. So 
she was like, no, I want to do the hair extensions. I was like, yeah, okay. But like, you know, I was like, well, be in touch with me. I just thinking, you know, she's someone from far away. She happened to be a half hour from my house. Oh, okay. So Lisa called up and set everything up. We started to stand and um, I spoke to her and she called me and my husband was like, you're crazy. You don't know this person. I'm like, listen, this girl seemed so sincere. And when I met her, I felt like I knew her forever. And it was her and Cindy and everyone in the salon that was so welcoming. But I have to tell you, the salon environment was so welcoming. She was so professional. And um, at one point, she was just so nervous. And I was like, listen, I'm just like any other regular customer, okay? <laughs> then I tried to tip her because she didn't charge me to do my hair. And I was like, no, I have to pay you. And she was like, no, it's on me. But um, she wouldn't take a tip. And what I did tell her is, because my daughter's having another baby and can't go on the road with me, I told her that I wanted to hire her. So she's going to be on the road with me from now on. Yeah, I have three grandkids. I have one on the way. I have two. I have two with one on the way. I have a 27, 27, 24, uh, 19, will be 20 in April. And then my daughter's 17. Wow. wow. And then two grandkids and one on the way. Well, let me ask you a question. You, you, you went from freestyle and you go and you do salsa. What is your passion, freestyle or salsa? I'm not going to put you out there, but um, I mean, you enjoy honestly, I, I think I love English, but I just think that English music is just... It's not that it's a difficult genre to it's be able to get yeah. your recognition again, mm -hmm. but I just feel like I, I, I love them both. To the point that if one day I'm singing in English, I'm loving it. One day I'm singing in Spanish. Mm -hmm. But I do think that with the band, it feels a lot more Lord. passionate. Mm -hmm. And I love to do the salsa and the boleros mm -hmm. because those songs have so much emotion. Not that English doesn't, but I think I'm more of a balladeer. I would love to right. do more ballads. But it's funny because my new single that I'm right now working on with Mike Cruz wow. is called I Rise Up. And it's crazy. We started writing it last night. And oh, okay. He sent the track. Nice. It's Too amazing. Many singles, huh? Too many singles. I know. <laughs> so we coming out with the new one, which is I Rise Up. I don't. It's probably gonna come out around the fall. But um, I, yeah, I think I think salsa has been my how favorite. How did you decide doing salsa? Is this between us when you do this? Because I needed a job. <laughs> ah, that's why. Right. I lost my yeah. record deal. You, oh, oh yeah. my god! I lost. Really? I was signed to Tommy uh -huh. Mottola, and then I got dropped. Okay. Yeah, but did you and like a Latino? You know, like. Well, my mother's Puerto Rican, and, uh -huh. and your dad is uh, my dad is Israeli. Uh -huh. really. So, how it happened was that I was out of a job, and I was taking odd and end jobs. I wasn't making ends meet. I was losing everything. I was a single mother, and um, I went to a music convention in Madame, which was in Cannes. And um, long story short, I got a friend of mine ran into me and was like, "Why are you working at the?" publishing side uh -huh. I was writing songs trying to solicit my songs like you should be singing so he's like you gotta meet my uncle he's here why don't you see if you can do, sing in Spanish so I was uh -huh. like I don't even know how to talk in Spanish <laughs> <laughs> he, was like, he was like yeah but you can learn he goes I know you did I still believe in Spanish I was like that's all I know and the bad Spanish, word right? yeah, but, but, you you but how it happened was yeah. I went to sing to his uncle and I sang a, a verse in necessary. the chorus uh -huh. and ironically he lived 15 minutes from my house and wanted a oh, meeting wow. when I got home uh -huh. in the States we had a meeting and I said, but my Spanish isn't good. And my mother was like, I don't care. I'll tutor her. I'll help her. So I just started watching the news and just really just concentrating on what the lyrics meant, uh -huh. translating them. And I got out. I picked it up and I learned Spanish in a matter of four That's years. Why wow. Wow. English English and and I mean, she has a Spanish name and she's totally English. Yeah. I have an English name and I'm totally Spanish. Are you? you know, I was born in Why <laughs> speak English, Spanish, Portuguese? But you understand it, right? Me too. And you like, and you said Bossa Nova before? Like Where you going? All right, but come back. You ain't going nowhere. All right, wait. What's your name? They got to Bossa Nova and Jazz before you jazz. No, I don't sing Bossa Nova, but I listen to Hiberto Nascimento. Oh, uh, I love Shakira's, uh, you know, obviously her Spanish music, but uh -huh. I don't know. I, just, I have a lot of versatility in all the music I, I uh -huh. sing. I love Laura Pausini's album when she did some of Portuguese. Oh, me too. Yeah. 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 So, I mean, I just yeah. I like to mix yeah. be versatile and just yeah. Yeah. with the music. Yeah. I listen I to hear. Yeah. Like my daughter, she won't only listen to R&B. 
She listens to jazz. Uh -huh. She listens to Neil Sedaka. She listens to Elton John. She'll listen to rock and roll. So there's just so much oh, variation. Oh, I like him more. I also, my son, son, yeah, my son is a <laughs> hockey player. I do talk about my son. Uh -oh. He's actually yeah, waiting yeah. To, um, to go to Canada and try out for some team, oh, I think nice. in Canada, and then British Columbia. But, you know, it, it's the same thing with sports. It's just yeah. like music. It's very controversial. I don't care how good you are. It's who you they know. Like. And how you blow, who I, you know. I'm sorry. Yes. Yeah, and that's why I, yes. I get where I get. I'm, I, hey, I may not be the most famous no. person, but I can say I got to where I got because of my hard work, not that's because right. I had yeah. to. So, Brenda, raise the okay. huh? We don't know where my son's going to play. <laughs> we don't know where he's going to play, well, but he's, I think he's amazing and I think he's a hard worker and the bad thing about certain sports is is the same thing as music it's who you know yep. and, and who your you connection know. is with and how you so I have know. to be honest yeah. with you I'm not trying yeah. to be cocky but I'm sure if he would have had like a Hispanic or somebody who knew his mother from That's the old it. days they probably would put him in the door there but they don't know go. us as Brenda K star or whatever they just know me as Brenda Patron for Patron's mom so when it's gonna happen, it's gonna happen because it's meant to be. Right. Just like with American Idol, we went in as yeah. Gianna Isabella right. and Brenda Patron. They only knew I was Brenda K. Star because so one of the it. people that worked yeah. in the music department right. was like, "Wait a minute, my dad managed her mother. Her mother's Brenda K. Star." Right, right. And then that's how it started trickling oh, in. Yeah. It's just long we also story. saw that so, you were doing a radio. So basically, yes. Yeah, yeah. How yeah. did you like that? Person. I loved oh, it. Okay. You loved it. Yeah. yeah. I loved Do you think it might continue or travel more? Oh, okay. So um, I mean, are we going to travel more with the radio thing or tra keep doing the radio thing? Keep doing the radio thing. Or is um, I mean, I did, I did get asked to to um, to do more radio, but I don't know. I mean, it just honestly is something that I can't do every single day and be committed to it unless I can do pre-recorded like I did when I was at Sirius XM. But um, I mean, I'm not. I'm. I mean, I love the radio thing, but I, I don't think I can abandon the music just yet. That's I still feel like it's my passion, right. but I, I, I eventually would like to retire and doing some type of radio thing. No, well, we're never retire. We're never. trying to name your show for you. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's so funny. Do you see my kids' Snapchats? We yeah, do my kids' Snapchats like, and name the way they get me. Oh, my God. <laughs> but you think, is that something you think you can get, you will be able to do eventually? Like radio? Well, we've been offered a reality yeah. show. Oh, and, oh my God. Yeah. We have do life pretty, like, no, it's like just everything at home. Uh -huh, uh -huh. And, and um, but we, uh, and we just didn't square it away. I think it was between USA TV and Oxygen TV, and uh, what was the uh, own TV? Uh -huh. But um, it was supposed to be done through Carmela Anthony and her and uh, Lala Anthony. They were mm -hmm. supposed to be the executive producers, but it fell through. So. The only live show you're going to get from me is at home on Facebook Live. That's about it. We oh my God. And, yeah. we, and then, you know, the amazing thing is we send you a note and by the time you look and read, we're already gone past. Yeah, I sometimes yeah. got to scroll yeah. back and pull yeah. it down, you know, because I try to answer as many as right. I So let me, let me tell you about Fangirl. What? So I call, I call the, Susan up and I says, listen. I, um, Brenda is coming in. Would you guys like, and forgive me for calling you Brenda. And it's okay. Thing, I don't no, know. you can call me Brenda. Okay. No more than me. <laughs> Come in, wait, wait, no more on. than me. <laughs> she's like, that's fabulous. You know, she did one of these. That's great. I said, Dalio. Would you like, oh my god, oh my god. Yeah, 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 I swear. Oh my god. I, just, I, I mean, feel it for yeah, guarantee. I swear. Right. She was oh like, no, no, she, no, she was working. Just from she just came from work right here. Yeah, I just came from work. And I just got this. You got to work like that? Yeah, like that. And a bitch, probably with bitch. And I'm like, oh my god, oh my god. I want to take this one. Oh my god, it's in Miami, no. Everybody, 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 everybody
En Perú, en Perú. En Perú. Yeah. 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 Siempre tengo que viajar en eso. Every, 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 my Spanish friends had a special song en español. Todas mis amigas querían cantar sus temas. All my friends, my single friends, Herida. Yeah. Everybody is la más famosa. Yeah, and this is like, oh my God. This is because you know, every my life. It's okay. I know. Thank you. Oh, awesome. I appreciate it. Believe me. Everybody needs the work. Everybody needs the work. Of course. Of course. Of course. But um, yeah. yeah, so I'm glad you guys are here. Oh my God! Yes, really. Really, when you did the fouls, I started dancing. I'm like, oh, I gotta sit down. My feet hurt now. <laughs> and it's funny because before I went on stage, my feet were killing me. But once you get there, it's different. Yeah. And when you go to play, what's your favorite place for it? My favorite place to be. I love Radio City Music Hall. But actually, I love Carnegie Hall. That was my favorite. Carnegie Hall. Carnegie Hall. She loves Carnegie Hall. Carnegie Hall is my favorite. Uh, yeah, huh. you know, can you hear me? Yeah, can we? Can they hear us if y'all talking? Yeah. Oh, so she sorry. said Carnegie Hall was yeah, her favorite said, place. Uh -huh. to Carnegie Hall. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. what I'm saying. Yeah. 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 I thought it would be New York. Oh, yeah. yeah. New York. Yeah. <laughs> There you go. Well, Brenda wants to get to her drinking. Oh, oh yeah. So thank you. Guys. Thank you thank for you. having us. We thank you. Amazing. Thank you for having us. We connected with you. I mean, like we we go and look at other. People that perform, other artists and stuff like that, and some of them like wouldn't even return our call, even on you know. And, and she just connected with we like, hey, this, no, this is like, oh like, my gosh. Yeah. She says she's really? like everybody. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. really nice person. And, and, to, oh, and to yeah. all those promoters who wouldn't hire her, really. Oh. Oh my God. <laughs> Okay, you know so we like right? to say yeah. we like to say thank you and we love you. Yeah, I can do that, thank right? You. Yeah. That was nice. Yeah. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, All right. Thank you. All right. End <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> She's on the